Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Muhammad's Boom Boom Room, where all of my guests either agree with me completely or they go boom. I am your host, the Prophet Muhammad. Peace be upon me. And with me now is one of the pillars of Western philosophy, the Prophet of Islam to the Greeks, Socrates. We have definitely done this before. Glad to meet you, Socrates. Wait, I remember. I keep exposing contradictions in your teachings and you keep blowing me up. So glad you could join me. I, is, is this hell? A am I in hell? What would you like to ask me? This is hell. I, I, I'm a man who loves having intelligent conversations with different people, and I'm stuck here with one guy having the stupidest conversations anyone has ever had with anyone else. Why am I in hell? Is there no savior? Well, as a wise man once said, a philosopher's hell is a prophet's paradise. No one ever said that. I just did. Alhamdulillah, I defeated the mighty Socrates in debate. Have you ever gotten a thirst that only a delicious glass of hemlock could quench? FYI, if you eat seven Ajwa dates in the morning, no poison can kill you. Look, if you're a prophet, tell me why we're here. Why is this happening? Why am I in hell? I once told my followers about my greatest desire. I said that I would love to be martyred in Allah's cause and then come back to life and then get martyred and then come back to life again and then get martyred and then come back to life again and then get martyred. <laughs> I just want to kill and get killed and then come back and kill some more and get killed and come back to kill some more and get killed. You're a philosopher. If you wanted to sum up my philosophy in two words, it would be kill, die, repeat. Wait, that's what's happening here? You wanted to keep killing people and dying and coming back, and now you keep blowing us up and then coming back so you can do it again? As I said, a philosopher's hell is a prophet's paradise. Look, just go ahead and push the button. I can't keep talking to you. It's like talking to a goat that was miraculously given the power to speak, but still had the cognitive faculties of a goat. So push the stupid button. Yes, the goat. I am the greatest of all time, the goat. But I don't want to push the button just yet. Let's enjoy ourselves for a few minutes. Even though I've got all eternity, I don't have time for this. Push the button. Wouldn't you rather discuss the scientific miracles of the Quran with me? Ah, oh, hemlock never tasted so delicious. Please shut up until the hemlock works its way up to my heart and kills me again. What? What are you smiling at? I slipped some Ajwa dates into your food earlier. Hemlock won't work. Push the button. You're here with me forever. Wait, didn't you die from being poisoned? We don't like to talk about that. Oh, we're going to talk about it, Dr. Muhammad, poison expert. Shut up about the poison. Shut up. Did you run out of Ajwa dates when that Jewish woman poisoned your food at Kaibar? I said, shut up! Hey, Mohammed, you just slaughtered my entire family! I'd like to cook you a delicious meal! Would you care for some of this scrumptious lamb? Duh, yeah, fix me up a plate, duh, I'm a prophet! You're going to make me do jihad on you! And didn't it take you like three years of total agony to finally die from the internal damage caused by that poison? Shut up! My body hurts just thinking about those three years! Thirsty Muhammad, 
Here's a bottle of toilet bowl cleaner. Here's a bowl of Allahu Akbar!